Hey guys, it's Emily. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be re-answering the questions from my Q&A number one on my old channel. And this video was posted March 24th, 2018. So it's been over two years and I feel like some of the answers might have changed over the two years. But I'm excited to also react to the video because I haven't seen it in a while. But yeah, before we get on to the video, make sure to press that like button. Comment down below what other videos you'd like to see and subscribe to my channel. Turn that button from red to gray and click the bell to get notified when I post a video. Now, let's re-answer the questions from my first Q&A. Alright, so I have the video over here again and let's start it. Oh, this is when I had my old intro. I have. But I'm gonna try it up. So. Doing my first Q and A, which you can see up here in the title. But basically, this is just a video for you to get to know me a little bit better. So let's just go ahead and get onto the video. All right. First question is: Are you a morning person or a night owl? I'm gonna answer before I, like my past self answers. Um, so I am a night owl, definitely. Um, I don't like to get up in the morning. I can get up in the morning, but I, if I have a choice, I'd rather not. Um, yeah, like, I don't like to get up early for school or anything like that. I mean, it's quarantine right now, so I haven't, I haven't had to get up early really, except for church. So, I'm definitely a night owl. I can stay up really late. Definitely a night owl. I'm not a morning person at all. I hate getting up in the morning. I've never been a morning person, I don't think. It's not I do. Can you do a split? I can do a right. I can do a right split. I can I can kind of do a middle split, not really though. And I cannot do a left split. Um, I will insert a video of me doing a right split right now. Hey there. So I'm going to be doing a right split. So I can do a right split. Yay. That is me doing a right split. I'm back. All right, so here we go. I'm, I was really close to being able to do a middle split. Um, I cannot do a left split. I might be able to do a right split. Let's see. Oh, oh no. no. Obviously, I wasn't stretching back then. Um, can you whistle? Yes. I think I can. There we go. Did your mother go to college? She did. she did. Do you believe in love at first sight? Um, I don't know. Why not? I mean, I think when you know, you know. Have I ever loved someone? like that no but I think sometimes you just know so why not I honestly don't even know <laughs> do you have a catchphrase yes it's so yeah every single video I say so yeah my mom says that in my um, videos I say so yeah a lot so yeah <laughs> Do you have pets? Yes. I do. He's actually right here. He came in my room. Oh, I can't get out. No, come here. Come here. Oh, okay. This is my dog, Cooper. He hates that I picked him up all. But I do have a pet. Yes. Sorry, buddy. Um, maybe it was last Saturday? Or like, in one of my previous videos, I did the puppy tie. So you can go watch that to see my pet. Do you know triplets? I do. Yes, I do. Do you like to dance? Yes. yes. Um, I, I have, I can dance. Yeah. Yeah. I'm in show choir, so I do, I dance. Yeah. Um, and sometimes I just dance around my room. So yes, I do like to dance. I do show choir, and a show choir video should be going up soon. So. I don't think it did. Do you remember your dreams? Sometimes. Sometimes I do. Like, I had a dream the other day where I was at Disney World and I was with two of my friends. 
my Sunday school teacher and my youth minister. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't remember that dream, but last night I had a dream that I was in Shanghai Disneyland because I've been telling, I've been like joking with my parents, like if y'all want to go to Disney World or a Disney Park, Shanghai Disneyland's open now. And I had a dream that we all went. So. Disney World. So, I remember that. Have you ever been in a beauty pageant? Yeah. Um, I have. Yes. I have been, Not anymore, though. I was in a couple when I was younger. Um, I don't do them now, though. Have you ever been to Olive Garden? I have. Duh. Olive Garden is amazing. I wanted to go there tonight, but my family's in Little Butter. You know the rest. How many countries have you been to? I have been to a whole whopping one country and that is United States of America and so I answer it's gonna be the same. One. United States, that's it. Alright, if you could eat if you could eat lunch with one famous person, who would it be? Hmm. Um I'd probably want to eat with Okay, so I think I'd want to eat um, lunch, if I had to eat lunch with one famous person, I want it to be like, I don't know, like maybe Jess Conti, because she seems like such a nice, genuine person, and she seems like she would, it'd be like a nice little lunch. I don't know. It would definitely be me, probably an actress. It's a toss-up between... Emma Watson or Candace Cameron. Hmm. Oh, one of them. But there's YouTubers too. Oh, gosh, I don't even know. That's a hard question. I don't know. Um, what type of music do you like the most? That's hard. I don't know. There's like a lot of different music. I mostly like only listen to worship. Disney, um, Jonas Brothers, that's about it, um, yeah, and when I say Disney, mostly, most of the Disney music is high school musical, <laughs> so. um, probably Christian, just because that's what I've been listening to more, like, that, and then, or, there's just like a mixture of songs. What are your nicknames or what do you prefer to be called? Besides I don't really have a nickname. I mostly just go by Emily. Um, sometimes I will get called M, like E-M. Um, that's about the only nickname that I have and it's not used that often. So I prefer to just be called Emily, but I'm fine with M too. That's your real name. Um, uh, I'd say my nickname, my nickname is probably M, like E-M, or just an M, um, or Eminem. What in the world? I've never been called Eminem in my life. Look, okay, would I like to be called Eminem? Sure, why not? I love that nickname, but no one has ever called me that in my whole life. Um... No, I don't know why I said that. I probably prefer to be called Eminem. Like I could be like the rapper Eminem. Oh my gosh. Look at me. What is the last uh, thing you watched on TV? Well, I haven't watched actual TV in a while. Um, I've been watching like on Disney Plus and Hulu and stuff. But the last thing I watched act that was actually on TV, I think, was Beauty and the Beast live action. It was on something. And, um, yeah, that was the last thing I watched on TV. Um, I watched... Oh, I watched the season finale of This Is Us tonight. Hmm. Great show. You should check it out if you haven't already seen it. We had a bunch of time because it comes back on fall. So catch up until then. Fun fact, that's the only episode of This Is Us I've ever seen. Like, I remember watching that. And that's the only episode I've ever seen. So I guess I recommend it to you, but I don't 
I don't really know what it's all about, but that's the only episode I've ever seen. What is your favorite time of the day? Well, all the time. When I'm not, like, not a school day. Right now it's spring break, so probably right now it'd be like probably around like six o'clock because my whole family's together. Sometimes we'll six o'clock. So, but on school day, <sighs> probably around ten o'clock, ten thirty, because I get to eat lunch. What male celebrity do you wish was your brother? Hmm. Um, what male celebrity do you wish was my brother? Probably, uh, probably Tom Holland. Because then I could say my brother is Spider-Man. Why not? Uh, Oh no. Probably Collins Key. I love that YouTuber. He's an awesome YouTuber. And he would be like super funny to have as like a brother. You know, what female celebrity would you like? Is your sister. Um, probably... Okay, I know it's two, but the Merrill twins. Because they they just seem like such nice people. I don't know. I couldn't just pick one of them to be my sister, so that's not fun. Um, you know what? I'm going to go with Emma Watson on this one. So Candace Cameron Bray would be the one I'd eat lunch with. And I'd love Emma Watson to be my sister. Interesting so, choices. What time do you usually go to bed? Well, on a school night, I would usually go to bed like 10.30. At the most, I'd be asleep by, I mean, wait. The latest I'd be asleep would be like 11.30. Um, in quarantine, the latest I have gone to sleep is probably 3.30 in the morning. Um, but I try to be in bed around midnight, and then I, I've been going to sleep around 12.31, which is not good, um, but... I try to go to bed by 10 o'clock and be asleep by 10.30 or 10.15 on just a Saturday night or, like, spring break right now. I don't really know. It's 10.19 at night right now, so I just go to bed whenever. What was your favorite TV show when you were a child? Ooh. I don't know. There's a lot of good shows that were on, like, Playhouse Disney, like, before it was Disney Junior. There were a lot of good shows on Playhouse Disney. There were some good shows on Nick. Um. Hmm. I think my favorite show, uh, I think my mom would say it was Dora the Explorer. But I really enjoyed The Backyard Again. That was a good show. Uh, my mom said I watched Dora the Explorer a lot. I really remember um, the Imagination Neighbors <gasps> yes. and Disney Junior. A lot of good Disney Junior shows. And then there's one more. Um, oh, Yo Gabby Gabba. I love yes. Yo Gabby Gabba. And Little Bill. Yes. There's just in the backyard kids. Yes. So many good shows. I agree. I agree with my past self. Too much to count. Too many to count. What was the name of your first pet? Tigger. My first pet's name was Tigger. It was cat. It's like yeah. orange and yellow. If you had a daughter, what would you name her? Hmm. Um. I don't know why, but I've always liked the name Lillian. Spelled L-Y-L-A-N. Like Dylan, but with an L at the beginning. So Lillian. I don't know. I've always liked that name. I don't know. I always come up with like girl names, and then I had the hardest time trying to come up with a uh, boy name. I don't know. I like the name Parker. I don't know. Um, I like the name Max, oh. and I like the name. Um, I had it in my head the other day. It was um from it's from the Bible. What's his name? I don't remember. 
it was something it was a name for the Bible, no. So I wanna name it from that. What's the worst grade you got on a test? And <laughs> got an F. Definitely. There's no telling. I think I made like an F. I remember I made an F. I've made an F before. On like some multiplying test in second grade. Oh, you made an F after that too. What's under your bed? You do not want to know. There's a lot of stuff under there I don't even know about. There's books, pillow thing, um, this toy dog I had when I was little, toy tiger I had when I was little. What was I going to see? I don't even know what's under my bed. Well, recently I redid my room. Like, I got new furniture and I have, like, a new bed. And my bed has, like, a drawer underneath it. And... To a stranger, I could see how it would look like it's a, a mess down there, but for me, it's organized. It's organized chaos. Um, it's in sections, but the sections kind of run together. I'm not going to show you, but I know what's under there. I know. It's, it's, it's clean to me. Okay. Where do you want to live when you grow up? I My dream place to live would be the Orlando, Florida area, just because I could go to Disney um, when I have a family, I would love to have, like, yearly pa yearly passes to Disney, and we can just go all the time. So, I'd love to live in, like, that area of Florida. I'd love to either live here in my hometown or Florida, like, where Disney World is. Yeah. Or, like, I don't know. I honestly don't even know where I want to live. It depends on where my job takes me. Especially, what do you want to be when you grow up? Well... It's changed a lot over the years. I wanted to be a teacher, and then I realized I didn't want to deal with kids for 30 years. I love kids, but I don't think I could deal with them for that long. Um, and then it changed to being an uh, optometrist, which is an eye doctor who does, like, the glasses and contacts prescriptions and all that. And then I realized I'd be good at science, and I'm not. Um, science is not my thing. And so right now, I either want to be an interior designer... Or I'd love to work at Disney World. I don't know. Interior designer is more want to be a teacher, like but then might could happen. Your job changes what you want to do, and I'm right now. If I want, if I was able to get a job right now, I would become an eye doctor. I, I want to be an eye doctor. Until you realize you need to have so like amazing. be good at science. Where mm. were you on Valentine's Day? Valentine's Day. I don't know. Let me look at it one second. Okay, so Valentine's Day was on a Friday this year. And so I would have been at school. And then I think I went to a middle school show choir competition after that. So that's, when I, that's where I was on Valentine's Day. I was, at, I was at school. Yeah, I was at school. It was on a school day. That's where I was. Yay. Who is the second to last person to call you? My mom, probably. My mom. My mom called me. <laughs> What's your favorite social media channel? Mm hmm. Well, I only have two. I have YouTube and Instagram. Um, I've never tried Twitter or Facebook. They just, like, it doesn't seem like it would interest me. Um, I've had Snapchat. I don't like Snapchat. Um... And I know, like, what? But no. I, Snapchat, I tried it, and I just, I didn't enjoy it. And so I deleted it. But, I don't know. It depends on the day, which one's my favorite, Instagram or YouTube. Um, and I don't have TikTok. TikTok doesn't interest me either. I had Musical.ly, but that was a while ago. Um, I'd say probably, I don't know, YouTube or Instagram. Whichever. I like both of them. That's hard. really like snapchat but youtube youtube is a great social media channel uh, or instagram by the way go follow me emily thompson nine underscore i remember it now i didn't um, know my own username probably youtube youtube's my favorite social media channel because it gives you like you're able to express yourself and you're able to watch other people express themselves so, probably hmm. would you rather have an american accent or a british accent 
Okay, I've thought about this question. So if I were to have a different accent for one day, I would definitely choose to have a different accent for one day. Um, between all the accents, I think I'd rather an Australian accent than a British accent. But to say I'd rather have a British accent forever, like, I don't think I'd want that. So I think I'm going to stick with my American accent because um, I don't think I'd like to have a British accent all the time. Oh, that's, that's my answer. A British. I think all Americans would say British and all British people. Except for me. American just because it's different than what you have. I can kind of do a British accent like, hello, hello, oh. my name is Emily. Um, I'm 13 years old okay. and this is my British accent. Mmm, why did I do British that? Accent. I don't even know the difference. Uh. What's your favorite color? Um, like... Favorite color, right now, it changes all the time, is light pink, like my water bottle. It's either this color light pink or this one. I just like light pink. I like light purple. I thought I was going to say light pink. And gray. All those together, great. Mm. Like that gray right there and that blue is also good. I like that light blue too. There's some purple up there that's good. There's so many colors. Like all the blue, gray, and purple family all together. It's exactly what I love. Would you go would you ever consider or go bungee jumping or skydiving? Skydiving, I think I would consider more than bungee jumping. I think bungee jumping I mean they're kinda of the same. You're jumping, um, and hoping for the best. Um I think bungee jumping though, like you're jumping and you're going so close to the ground. I think I'd rather skydiving. I've heard a lot, I've heard a lot of good experience about skydiving, like how it's so much fun, how people do it again. Um, bungee jumping, I don't hear a lot about. So I'd probably, I'd consider skydiving more than bungee jumping. Bungee jumping. <laughs> Maybe skydiving, just because it's like out there, it's something that sounds fun. It's out there. Bungee jumping, I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I'd consider. Maybe. I don't know if I'd actually do that. And then the last question is, what's your favorite video that you've posted on YouTube? Obviously, this is my um, third video on YouTube. Um... So, my favorite video I've ever posted on YouTube, though, so this is including my other channel, is probably, probably the Disney vlogs. They're the videos I go back and watch the most, just because it's so fun to watch, like, your trip at Disney. Um, so yeah, all the Disney vlogs are my favorite videos. Um, probably... I really enjoyed all the Disney vlogs. Very I liked video. I like filming those. I like all the videos I filmed with my brother. I do like those too. Those were fun. Uh, this is so hard. It's really not that hard. All the videos I posted. You know, uh, the most fun I've had filming a video is probably my travel back for Disney World. That is one of my favorite videos I've ever posted. I forget about it because it's just not like, I don't know. I just don't think about it. That is one of my favorite videos I've posted. I don't even know why. It's literally me showing you what's in my bag for Disney World. Like the bag I'm going to take into the parks. I don't know why I enjoyed it so much. Maybe just because I was so excited for Disney. I don't know. That is one of my favorite videos though. And um, that was the last question. And I hope you enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to press that like button. Comment down below what other videos you'd like to see. And subscribe to my channel. Turn that button from red to gray. And click the bell to get notified when I post a video. That's all for today. And I'll see you guys next Saturday. Bye!